everyone. Today I have for you 12 boosters. I have 4 Magic Origins uh, boosters and I have 8 of the Fate Watch boosters. Essentially a fat pack. I bought these at a discount so I thought about opening for you guys. So here we go. First we have Weight of the Underworld, Anacron Sergeant, a charging, a charging Griffin, a Aerial Volley, a Maritime Guard, an Undead Servant, Treadwaters, Anissa's Pilgrimage Suppression Bonds Veteran Sidearm A Ravaging Blaze An Angel Stone An Anchor to the Aether And a Rare, an Orbs of Warding You have X Proof If a creature would deal damage to you, prevent one of that damage which this can be useful for our first turn here and we have our basic land and a token we have a copper waltz a volcanic rambler and then print tactician a Fetid Imp, an Aspiring Aeronaut, an Elvish Visionary, an Alchemist Vial, an Antuco Husk, a Bellows Lizard, a Leaf Gilder, a Warhorn, a Necromantic Summons, a land, non-basic, a rock's passage, and we have a rare, a battlefield forge. Add one to your map pool. Add a red mana, white mana to your map pool. Battlefield forge deals one damage to you. A zombie token in, a, in the land. We have an, an Akron Trailer, a Formable Archer, a Callable Root, an Enshrouded Mist, a Hitch Club Clues, Pond to Ash, Ring Border Owl, Mantle of Webs, Bogart Root, another Alchemist File. A Sphinx Tutelage, Gather the Pack, a Revenant, and we have a Jace Prince Prodigy. Oh my god, this card is really good. So that flips into Jace Telepath Unbound. Holy crap. Nice, very nice. That's a nice pull. Have a token. And the flip card. Our last magic card in this pack. We have an Avon Battle Priest, a Night Snare, we have a Bone to Ash, Farragus Disciple, Vine Snare, Heavy Infantry. A Bricklebor, a Reef Soul, Dreadwaters, Rock Smallers, a Brawless Plate, a Fiery Conclusion, an Enthralling Victor, Exquisite Firecraft, is ah, it's a rare. 
uh, exquisite firecraft is full of damage to target creature or player. It's really good. I, I didn't read the chase card, but then I'll, I'll see, see the rares again. And now we begin with our both cards. Should reorganize this. So, yeah. Come on. We got a Jace, so it's all good. <laughs> Begin with our oath cards. We have a dazzling reflection, a Nakum fire seeker, a corpse shurn, an isolation zone, a Maw Kozilek, a witness the end, a warden of geometries, a natural state. Containment membrane, a seer's lantern, a grip of the royal, an immobilizer gel trazi, an immolating glare, and we have a world breaker. It has the void and has no color. When you cast world breaker, exile artifact, enchantment, or land it has reach. For two random mana and one colorless sacrifice the land return world breaker from your graveyard to your hand and we have a swamp and an octopus token let's see if we can get a Kozilek or Chandra we already got a chase we have a coarse sky climber a consumed sinkhole Hold out settlement. A McKinney Aeronaut. A Boulder Salvo. A Corpse Churn. Science Summoner. A Negate. A Sears Lantern. Netcaster Spider. A Step Glider. A Seed Guardian. A Grip of the World. And we have a corrupted crossroads. Add a uh, color is a mana to your mana pool. Pay one life. Add one mana of this color, of any color, to your mana pool. Spend this mana only to cast a spell with the void. And the planes. And the zombie token. We have a Mankini Aeronaut, a Polar Salvo, a Corpse Churn, a Searing Light, a Spark Mage's Gambit, a Tar Snare, a Lead by Example, a War Isle Avenger, Pulsum Rasa, Umar Entangler, a Weapon Strainer, it's a good card, a Special Contortion, the Varwin Flames, and we have Remorseless Punishment. Target opponent loses 5 life unless that player is cast through cards or sacrifices a creature or planeswalker. Repeat this process once. We have uh, an island and an Eldrazi Scion. Oof, starting to get full here. Still not very good pulls. Except for the chase, we have a mighty leap, a reality emerge, we have a waste, a sky scour, a McKinney aeronaut, a Zadus commando, a bone saw, 
Saddleback Lagak, Little War Isle Avenger, Crumbly Vestige, Juraga Auxiliary, Immolating Glare, A Gift of Tusks, and a Dimensional Infiltrator. Has Flash, Flying, and 4 mana. Uh, one colorless target opponent exiles the top card of his or her library. If it's a land card, you may return the target the dimensional infiltrator to its owner's hand. And we have a swamp and I'll try this cyan. Four more to go. Have a Zadas Commando. A witness the end, spawned by their mage, an expedite, Kozilex translator, oh, what finds of the recluse, containment membrane, crumbling vestige, netcast a spider, obtruse interference, prophet of distortion, cliffhaven vampire, essence depleter, and we have a Linvala the Preserver. When it has flying, when Linvala the Preserver enters the battlefield, and if an opponent has more life than you, you gain 5 life. When Linvala enters the battlefield, if an opponent controls more creatures than you, put, it, put a 3-3 free, free white angel creature token with flying onto the battlefield. That's a nice pull. We have a forest and an octopus token. Alright. Yeah, could be worse. We have a natural endurance. We have shoulder to shoulder. We have a Zetis Commando. We have a Zulaport Chain Rage. A Dazzling Reflection. And a Kung Flame Seeker. A Deju Path Warden. A Cosmic Pathfinder. Science Summoner. A Canopy Forger. Shitness Cloak. Another Weapon Strainer. Of white shatter, and we have an Ultrazi mimic. Whenever another colorless creature enters the battlefield under your control, you may change Ultrazi mimic's base power and toughness to that creature's power and toughness until the end of the turn. It's, it's really good. Another forest. We have go to our seven booster. We have a Vampire Envoy, a Holdout Settlement, Underwar Cleric, a Brute Strength, a Cosmic Shrieker, an Adrian Crawler, Pulse of Marasa, Slip Through Space, Containment Membrane, Binds of the Recluse, Flame Tendrils, Wall of Resurgence, a Gazul Stroll Collector, a Bearer of Silence, the Void, when the Eucharist Bearer of Silence may pay one generic one colorless, if you do, target opponent sacrifices a creature, has flying and it can block. We have a, a Mountain and an Ultrazi Scion. To our last booster box, ooh, card, card of cards. <laughs> Come on. I'm not even asking for a expedition. <laughs> that would be sweet. We have a Syrian Light, a Spark Mage Scambit, a Tar Snare, a Course Side Master, an Expedite, an Oblivion Strike, a Blinding Throne, Warden of Geometries, a Natural State, Containment Membrane. Weapon Strainer, a Special Contortion, Devouring Flames, and we have a Stone Forge Masterwork. Equipped creature gets plus one plus one for each other creature you control that shares a creature type with it. That's here. And we have a Swamp and an Elemental Token. So that was it for our magic 
the origins we have an uh, exquisite firecraft, the chase telepath and bound, five loyalty. God, this card is really good. Draw a card and discard a card if uh, there are five or more cards in your graveyard. Exile Jace, Rinse Prodigy, then return him to the battlefield to transform and under you get so much control. Is plus one loyalty ability is plus one up to one target creature gets plus minus two minus zero until the next turn. Minus three is may cast target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard this turn. If that card would be put into a graveyard this turn, exalt instead. And it's when it's ultimate minus nine is you get an emblem when whenever you cast a spell target opponent puts the top five cards of his or her library onto his or her graveyard. Yeah, we have a uh, spell fields forge or it's orbs of warning, exquisite aircraft. And we go, now we have our oath. It's Stormforge ma Masterwork, Bearer of Silence, Eldrazi Mimic, Alien Alien Violet. Dimensional Infiltrator, Remorseless Punishment, and a Corruptor Crossroads, and a Brutal Breaker. We got a few Eldrazi, so it wasn't too bad. So that was it. I hope you enjoy it. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.